Commercial harvesting of baobab trees is a good thing for the baobab resource because it creates economic value for the trees and it gives rural people an incentive to sustainably manage them and look after them. But the question is always asked, does the harvesting of the fruit by people and the removal of the fruit have any form of negative environmental impact on the trees? And I can tell you what I think, but it's much better to demonstrate it scientifically and that's what we're doing here. This here is a baobab resource assessment. We've got a bunch of ecologists. They are going out in an area from where baobab fruit are harvested. They are measuring the trees. They're counting the fruit. They're looking at the flowers. They're looking at the health of the tree. All kinds of factors that relate to the health and the sustainability. And what we're doing here is we're setting up a permanent sample plot or a whole series of permanent sample plots where researchers can come back year after year after year to assess the exact same trees and make sure that there are no negative impacts from the commercial harvesting of the fruit. So guys, I am Gus, the African plant hunter. I'm here in Matabeleland North in Western Zimbabwe, uh, the district of Binga. This is quite a well-known uh, baobab harvesting area. And this is a new project for us, setting up permanent sample plots for the baobab trees in this area with this young team of researchers who are being trained on the job so that in future they can do this on their own in many different parts of the country. Very exciting piece of work. And just to show you guys that uh, we do take the sustainability of baobab harvesting very seriously uh, and make sure that there's absolutely no chance that we could be in any way having a negative impact from this. And I hope to be able to demonstrate ultimately that of course we're having a positive impact because these trees are being protected rather than then cleared for agriculture. So that's it guys. I hope you've enjoyed this little very short snippet from uh, Wangi. I will catch you again later. If you've enjoyed it, plenty more on my YouTube channel, Facebook and Instagram. Just type in African Plant Hunter. You will find me there. All right, guys, I'm off to measure some more bear baths. I will catch you later. Take it easy. Bye.